Hello everyone, I just want to put out a help video on how to um, specifically um, plot the latitude and longitude uh, for the Locating Active Volcanoes Lab. So on this lab you have a series of volcanoes with latitude and longitude. And so I just want to remind you if you need a little help on um, how to plot these. Starting with the first one here, 64 degrees north latitude and 19 degrees west longitude come down to our map here and I want to note that first of all latitude or sorry the longitude is your position east or west of the prime meridian and the prime meridian is here okay and so your position east or west of the prime meridian is your longitude so I'm going to go ahead and write longitude here prime meridian is here and so anything um, any of these uh, to the east of the prime meridian is east longitude, and anything west of the prime meridian is west longitude. So this would be east longitude over here, and this would be west longitude over here. Okay. Now the prime meridian, it runs through uh, an observatory in Greenwich, England. That's where they put it. And they basically connected a line from the, the North Pole down to the South Pole. And so that's the zero point. Anything east is east longitude towards China. Anything west towards the United States is west longitude. Okay. <clears throat> Likewise, we have a latitude mark. And the latitude is over on this side. So these are the latitudes. And um, this mark right here is the equator. So anything above the equator is north latitude. And anything uh, below the equator is south latitude. Okay, And you'll note that all these measurements have an N for north latitude or an S for south latitude. And likewise, when you do work with um, longitude, you're going to have an E for east longitude and a W for west longitude here. Okay, so our first point is 64 degrees north, 19 west. So first of all, 64 degrees north would be going this way to 64. Now we're going to assume that 70 is directly between 60 and 80, so 64 is going to be probably right about here-ish. Okay, and um, so 64 is right about here. So anywhere along this line right here is 64 degrees north latitude. Okay, and our longitude was 19 degrees west. So we come over here, 20 degrees west is here. So 19 degrees west is going to be right about here. So this point is where this line and this line meet. Okay. 19 degrees west and 64 degrees north meet about right here and boom that point is right about there and so we're going to go ahead and label that number one okay now you're going to then go to page um, 262 and 263 in your book and find out what the plate what plates are involved here? If it's one or more plates, you can go ahead and write them both in if there's two. And then what environment this is, okay? Now, from working with these, I happen to know that this point right here in Iceland, this is Iceland, and if I'm looking at the world map, my plate names would be the North American plate, and the Eurasian plate. Further, I know that that volcanic zone is a divergent boundary. Okay, and I know that because Iceland is one of our prime examples of a divergent boundary. So that's the volcanic zone. So that's how you do this um, section in this lab. Go ahead, go ahead and go through and plot all these volcanoes by their latitude and longitude. Then using the book, identify the plate names in the volcanic zone.